I'm from Rochester, New York, so I turned left at Cleveland. And actually, I was in the South for quite a while, and I, I found out about the uh, Eureka Springs. It's, I won't go into the whole story, but it's just living down south, living in Alabama and Memphis, and sooner or later I found out about the school in Memphis, went there for four years, college, and then came to Eureka Springs. Well, it's a girl. My wife, uh, I met my wife at the Art Academy in Memphis and we came, we decided to come here and that's that part of the story. The other part is that was military service in Redstone for three years. Oh, we're friends and we decided to, to open up a gallery of uh, some of the fine artists that are here. I'll use that word safely. And a few years ago, and this is our second location, but we're keeping our heads above water here in Eureka Springs. It's not easy right now. It's a lot going against art and art uh, galleries and stuff as far as making money. I just, I like to create things and sometimes it's not always with paint, but I'm in such a limited space right now that uh, I have to refrain from going too big or too crazy. I would say oil is my favorite uh, if I had to pick something, but you know, I, I love acrylic, art colors, pastel, anything, it doesn't, you know. And uh, other than pe just painting picture pictures, I like to paint more of, of an abstract idea. Maybe, maybe even if there's a scene there, kind of make it a little more fantasy than what's really there. I'm not a realist. Uh, it's just the pace is different here. I've been in the South a long time. I shouldn't say the South, but I've been down South a long time. Pace is different than it is up North. Right now we're having kind of a slump in art. We're, you know, we're still selling and doing all right. And people take on commissions and things like that. But we're trying to have a gallery that's a step above just a, a flea market. And, well, <laughs> many steps above. But, you know, we, want, we don't want to have a junked up gallery with everything going on. And we may sell, uh, it may cost us some sales, but we got pride. Well, right now it's location, getting people, getting more people up here. Eureka's a funny place as far as uh, where you're located. You can be located 20 feet from one building that's doing gangbusters and you're doing nothing. It's a strange place. So we're working on uh, keeping the gallery open, selling more work, of course, and trying to uh, get more people that come to the town, get them up here. And we, we battle with that probably more than anything. So without people, I mean, what are you going to do? A lot of us are a little older in retirement age. I know I am. I don't have to do this, but I want to do it. And I think most, I think everybody in here is doing because they want to do it. I, I, I couldn't do anything else. I'm just. I'm too old to change, make changes now anyway, and I'm, I'm just going to see it out to the end and uh, enjoy it.